Hey everybody, welcome to my channel, Creative by Nature. My name is Donna. Today I'm taking part in the Using Trash to Create Treasure Challenge. This is a challenge hosted by Casey from Coffee with My Sunshine, as well as Kat from According to Kat. I will have a playlist for you all to see down in the description box, as well as links to both those ladies' channels. They're amazing, creative people. I'd love it if you check everybody out. Let's hop into the project. Okay, so these are the items that I am going to be turning from trash and turning it into treasure. This is a maple syrup jug. It's plastic. I have already removed the label and it still has some sticky stuff on it, but that's not going to affect the project. And I have these three glass bottles. Again, labels have been removed already. And then I will show you the other items that I will be using as well. Some additional supplies you are going to need are some dried grasses from your yard or garden. I also have some fern leaves and just some dried seed pods. Some spray paints. I have one in a fine textured finish. It's kind of a stone color. And then I also have the frosted glass spray. And I also have some jute twine and some raffia. For my first project, I'm going to take this jug outside and spray paint it with the textured fine finish in the stone color. I'll go do that and then I'll come back and show you the result. So my jug is all dry. It's got lots of texture to it. I really like that. And for some added detail, I decided to add these really pretty tags that I got from Dollar Tree as well as some clear word stickers. So I'm going to put one on here, one of each on there, and then I'm also going to add some decorative twine. Okay, so I've given the glass bottle one coat, generous coat, of the frosted spray paint. You can see the difference between the two bottles right here. You can tell that this one's a lot more matte. And just for a nice finishing little touch, I am going to add a bit of raffia to the top, and then I will show you how I will display these. 